Hey. Good morning children. This is your Bincy Ma. In this video, we are going to read the third chapter in our English literature of term 2. That is Little Red Riding Hood. As soon as the wolf began to feel that he would like a decent meal, he went and knocked on grandma's door. When grandma opened it, she saw the sharp white teeth, the horrid grin, and the wolfie said, May I come in? Poor grandma was terrified. He is going to eat me up. She cried, and she was absolutely right. He ate her up in one big bite. But Grandma was small and tough, and Wolfie wailed. That's not enough. I haven't yet begun to feel that I have had a decent meal. He ran around the kitchen, helping. I have got to have another helping. Then added with a frightful leer. I am therefore going to wait right here till little Miss Red Riding Hood comes home from walking in the wood. He quickly put on Grandma's clothes. Of course he hadn't eaten those. He dressed himself in coat and hat. He put on shoes and after that. He even brushed and curled his hair, then sat himself in Grandma's chair. In came the little girl in red. She stopped, she stared, and then she said, What great big ears you have, Grandma! All the better to hear you with, the wolf replied. What great big eyes you have, Grandma, said Little Red Riding Hood. All the better to see you with, the wolf replied. He sat there watching her and smiled. He thought, I am going to eat this child. Compared with her old grandmama, she is going to taste like caviar. Then Little Red Riding Hood said, But Grandma, what a lovely great big furry coat you, you have on. That's wrong, cried Wolf. Have you forgot to tell me what big teeth I have got? Oh, uh, well, no matter what you say. I'm going to eat you anyway. The small girl smiles. One eyelid flickers. She whips a pistol from her knickers. She aims it at the creature's head. And bang, bang, bang. She shoots him dead. A few weeks later in the wood, I came across Miss Riding Hood, but what a change, no clock of red, no silly hood upon her head. She said, hello, and do please note, my lovely furry wolfskin coat, by Royal Dahl. Now let's have a look at the word meanings. First, terrified, that is scared. Second is wailed, 
that is cried third is leer that is cunning smile next is caviar that is a seafood fishes or eggs delicacy and the last is tough that is very strong and next comes the opposites first sharp opposite blunt second horrid opposite pleasant third is decent opposite indecent so that's all for this video we will meet in our next video thank you stay home stay safe thank you